this problem we want to factor the trinomial. So we got uh, 36 x squared plus x minus 2. Now our first method is GCF, but these don't have anything in common. Grouping is four more terms. That doesn't fit. Uh, PST is close, except for there's a number in front of the x squared. So key number is the one we want to use. Now why we want to use that is because we have x squared, x, no x, and there's a number in front of our x squared. Now with the key number, it takes the number at the beginning times the number at the end, ignoring signs, 30, 36 times 2, and that gives us 72. And we'll come up with our three columns. The p column, we're going to write down all products, give us 72. We got 1 times 72, 2 times 36, 3 times um, 24, 4 times um, 18, 5, no, 6 times 12, 7, uh, 8 times 9. In the S column, we want to add these numbers together. 1 plus 72 is 73, 2 plus 36 is 38, 3 plus 24 is 27, 4 plus 18 is 22, 6 plus 12 is 18, 8 plus 9 is 17. Difference column, we want to subtract smaller from larger. 72 minus 1 is 71. 36 minus 2 is 34. 24 minus 3 is 21. 18 minus 4 is 14. 12 minus 6 is 6. 9 minus 8 is 1. Now, number we're looking for is a number in a middle term. There is no number here, so it's invisible 1, which is right here, which means we use 8 and 9. First term carries down, last term carries down, and we're going to rewrite our middle term using these two numbers. Now, a larger number in the p column that we're using, which is a 9, is always going to be the same sign as the middle term, which is positive. Now, the number I circled is in the difference column, d for different signs. So if the 9 is positive, then the 8 will be negative. Now, we want to use factoring by grouping. So group first two terms and group the last two terms. Now, the first two terms have a GCF of 9x, and that gives us 4x plus 1. The second group, um, both divisible by 2, my first term is negative, so I factor out a negative 2, and that gives us 4x plus 1. Now, our goal was to get this parenthesis the same as this parenthesis, which they are. So I factor out a 4x plus 1, and to, to figure out what's in your second set of parentheses, you can cross out the 4x plus 1s up here. And what isn't crossed out is what goes over here, which would be 9x minus 2. So that would be our answer. 4x plus 1 times 9x minus 2.